JJ, meet Jay Heaps, your new boss. This is MLS Now. Hey, I'm Jason Seguini on MLS Now, and no matter which way Jermaine Jones made his way to the New England Revolution, the fact is he's headed to the Revs and head coach Jay Heaps has to be thrilled. Jones has a bit of a bad rep for his off-the-field antics and his on-the-field transgressions, but the reality is he's a top talent that offers the Revs an upgrade in the middle of the park in two key areas. The first is bite. He's tough in the tackle and covers a ton of ground in the middle of the field, both areas that need an improvement for New England. He could, in the end, line up in several different positions within that central midfield. I could see him starting deeper while he works his way back into fitness, but he also has the skill set to play higher in the attack with the physical ability to recover on the defensive side when needed. Playing higher will highlight the second area he'll impact. He's a great passer of the ball and can create chances from anywhere in the midfield. Current deep midfielders Scott Caldwell and Andy Dorman just don't have the same ability when it comes to that cutting pass to open up a defense. So while it's clear that Rev fans will see an upgrade in the midfield at some point, the question is when? Integrating a player coming off his offseason into the side, and a league for that matter, that is as fit as it will be all year, will be a difficult task for heaps. The Revs have 10 games left. Is Jones the piece that pushes them above the red line and into the playoffs? Or could trying to integrate him this late in the season be what causes New England to fall off the pace down the stretch? Let me know what you think in the comments section below.